Resident Evil. Hello and welcome to Let's Play Resident Evil 1, the original, the classic, not the remake, fucking remake, I don't like it, why don't I ever like the remake? I like the original soundtracks more, I like the original puzzles more, the original mansion layout, I think the Crimson Zombies are stupid, and you already only have 6 inventory slots as Chris, now you need 2 of them for the benzene, the gasoline, and for a lighter to always burn them. I think Chris always uh, like has an item like always, so it doesn't count as a slot, but still then this still takes up one slot. He only has six, so prefer this for atmosphere and stuff. All things I told about talk that out. Yeah, let's go. Then evil. I'm a fan of Chris, I played this on Chris, with Chris, I mean, um, yeah, I played with Chris, it was pretty hard, a tough nut. I never finished it with Jill, and I think there are way too many videos with Jill, so I'm like, let's play Chris, but I never played Jill, so, gonna hate me, but Harry's gonna hate. Sorry for the low, low resolution, but that's just how it is with this game. Reckon Forest. Enjoy the triple A intro. Flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of our mission. Interesting. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims. Apparently eaten. Apparently eaten. Bravo team went to the hideout of the group and disappeared. Smoke. Oh, I'm sorry, CGI smoke. This here's real smoke. Bravo team's helicopter. Nobody was in it. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. Mm. However, we, we soon discover started. why. Should shut up, but it's just so awesome this intro. Chris, the man, the real quiz. Chris Redfield. I think his scream and the face he makes are the only thing really trashy about this intro because I actually like it. But the uncensored version is trashy because of the zombie dog gore. My opinion. Roger that, Chris. Prepare for pure epicness. Chris Redfield. Jill Valentine. Mary Burton. Rebecca Chambers. Albert Wesker. Resident Evil. 
the escape dimension. Wow, what a mansion! Wesker, where's Chris? Like a badass, let me handle this. Stay alert. Roger that. Yeah, the animations are a bit faster because I'm playing it on a modern PC. But on most PCs, this is like 100x the speed, so I'm actually like it's working like this. The controls are still like before, yes. Good. I am live for that. I don't know, tell me. What is it? Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll, I'll be examining this. this. Hope this is not Chris's blood. Me too, Barry, me too. And um, we'll need this later. Since we have eight inventory slots, I'll just poop. I'll poop it with me. And let's go. Kill me, I accidentally skipped the cutscene. Oh my. No, kill me, literally. Wait. Ah, there's no way to get around this. I didn't think every button skips the cutscene, but okay. We're just going to speed through this. See then, evil. They could have used a real animation to make the screen white, but it does this shit. Okay, fast forward, kinda not. Roger Wesker, you're the man. Stay alert. The dining room. Yes. By the way, let's playing this game is kind of dangerous because you can skip the draw animations, but that tends to make the game crash for me. So enjoy that. Let's go. And tomato. What is it? Tomato sauce. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Hope this is not Chris's blood. Chris's blood. Emblem. I think actually Resident Evil 1 has better quality than 3. Because if we go to the inventory screen. Inventory screen. The things are in 3D. In Resident Evil 3 and 2, I think they're just 2D pictures. Kind of got lazy on that Capcom, did you? Weep, weep, weep. Enjoy. One of the most classical cutscenes ever. Hmm. Hi, Mr. Zumbo. Um, going to do this very tactically, as I always play. Hi. Run. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're going to examine this dead body because there is something. And I see we're out of time because failed stuff. So, it's going to hit that button and then we'll be right back. We are back. And up and running. Yes. There are two clips. No, no. 
Man smashing. Man. He's just annoying, but he's not a threat anymore. I call such things zombies. Maybe by this creature. Anyway, let's report this to Wesker. Oh, rapport. I don't speak French. <laughs> go, go, Power Rangers. I don't know why I feel like if, if I'm running at this game. Very secure. Find anything, Jeff? Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. Beats me too. Now it's Wesker's time to disappear. I don't know what's going on. Well, it can't be helped. Let's search for him separately. I'll check the dining room again. Okay. I'll try the door on the opposite side. This mansion is gigantic. We could get into trouble if we get lost. That's true. We should start from the first floor, okay? And Jill, here's a lockpick. It might be handy if you, the master of unlocking, take it with you. Thanks. Maybe I'll need it. Listen, if something happens, let's meet up in this hall. This time I'll be there. Promise? Okay. There's a ink ribbon here, which the game doesn't show you. Kind of a little secret though, and let me show you something. I didn't notice my mouse was in the screen the whole time. Um, fuck professionalism, YouTube was broadcast yourself once, so I'm going to have fun doing this let's play. Why was my mouse there? Because for some games it's like, I don't know, not that bad to see it. You see where I am and the menus, stuff. But because the resolution, the mouse is gigantic, like this mansion. So, Oniva, let's go. Skip. Mm, I love this music. This music break is so. Mm. So we don't need this card, but just for completion's sake. And if I get lost, whatever, because I'm a big dum dum, I'll need this card. I'm oh, sorry, this map. This map. We are in English. We don't call them cards. Oh, Mr. Zambo doesn't want to buy it. That's just great. <laughs> Let, let's just provoke him a bit. Because we are the douches we are. Okay, I think we can provoke him anymore in the future. He says he, he will be there, Barry, if something happens, so let's test that out. Barry, you failed me! <laughs> you use lockpick. With Chris we would need the sword key, which is a very annoying. Sexy face. Mm. 
There's a green herb, but we don't need it right now, do we? Oh, her HP are so much lower than Chris's. Of course, can survive three more zombie bites. Doesn't sound much, but the thing is that the bites from the crawlers that are crawling on the ground are almost not doing damage to them. The normal bites, he can survive three more, though. Let's get a new arm. Arming's weapon, but in this context, no one would use this word for weapon. What I want a le arm. The shotgun. Uh, let's take the pistol for safety reasons. Safety measurements. I'm panicking! Ah! Help me! Someone! Do you have to... It's locked? I don't know! Kick this door down. You were almost a jibbled sand. You're right. Barry, thanks for saving my life. But Barry, didn't you say you're going back to the dining room to do some research? Why on earth are you here? Uh, I just had something I wanted to check. Now, let's get back to searching for the lost captain and Chris, shall we? Thing is, he's not to say... He's known to say Jewel Sandwich, which he kinda says in the GameCube version and remake. Which is basically the GameCube version. Um but here I don't understand Jewel Sandwich always here. We were almost a Jewel sandwich or jeweled. Not Jewel Sandwich though. You do it similar, but yeah. Hi. Bye. Uh, if you shoot up one of their arm, which is kind of random, they're easier to shake off. And we get more clips. And no inventory sorting, so that doesn't work that well in this game. Combine. I'm surprised I didn't uh, say Kurvanandeska because I have the habit of saying that when I shoot something in Resident Evil with a pistol over the Magnum, especially with the Magnum, even though it means or is that? Yeah, I'm a weirdo. Don't mention it. We don't need a shotgun now, increments no knife. The knife. Okay, I think we're good to go. Just doing a small cut here and we'll be right back. <laughs> 